you will completely understand my dilemma with today so if you're watching this Ian you will understand so we've just been placed in non-priority <laughs> non-priority boarding which has been a story of the day so um, yeah um, all will be unveiled obviously with what's going on in a couple of weeks but um, non-priority is the word of the day Are you still Volkswagens? Yes, boys.
Job done here in in Spain. Um, good test. Uh, happy to have a familiarisation with the car. Um, yeah, nice to get back uh, back in the seat. And uh, yeah, Rodri alongside. He did a great job. So yeah, nice to meet the new team. Um, running with Mapo Motorsport this year. So teams run by Chevy Pons, um, which um, you probably will have heard his name from pre previous years in WRC. So. If you don't, um, we might I might chuck a link in actually of, uh, of, a, of a, ch a famous Chevy Pons clip. Um, I'm sure you'll all be familiar with that. Um, I don't think he might uh, want to remember the clip, but anyhow, you can have a look. Del Barrio. Performance from Pons and Del Barrio. And they drop nearly a minute and tumble four places. Yeah, happy with everything. Um, like I say, nice to get back in. Um, you know, happy with the Skoda. It's it's very very different uh, compared to the Polo. So. Yeah, a lot to get used to. Um, you know, with a couple of things that uh, that are different. You know, Stefan on board as well. Um, so yeah, we'll we'll see how it goes. Um, see how Poland is, and um, yeah, hopefully give it our best shot and see how it goes. Yeah, Rodri was here a couple of weeks ago um, doing Rally Costa Brava, so. He's my tour guide for, for today, so we've decided to, rather than go back to the hotel, that we go and have a look at some of the sites that um, that's here and obviously some old uh, WRC stages. But um, if you know your WRC locations, you'll probably be familiar with this place. Um, you might have to ignore the, the rude Spanish word on the ground, but um, yeah, if you know where this place is, or if you don't, um, yeah, go look it up. So uh, I'll try and put a clip in just to see. Jill Panitzi was the man around here, so um, yeah, very famous place and a uh, big part of uh, Rally Catalonia's history. 60 mètres, épingle gauche.
trip complete, um, well sort of, um, as a standard thing with uh, a certain airline, I won't mention any names, but um, we're delayed again so it looks like it'll be um, daylight when we get back home to to Wales. So um, yeah, all in all, uh, apart from all the delays, a uh, good trip, you know, um, nice to finally get on the, on the road again and um, yeah, really looking forward to, to getting out in, in Poland in a couple of weeks. A rally that I've done before, um, again Stefan with me, so yeah, two weeks now to prepare for the, for the first round of, uh, of our programme this year. So um, yeah, hopefully you've seen something or enjoy this video and um, yeah, we'll keep you posted with how we get on in, uh, in Poland.